What's up everybody, it's Daydreams. Welcome back to the channel for another Clash of Kings video. If you are new here, consider subscribing. We do daily videos here on the channel. Make sure to tell your alliance about the channel because you will get better from all these videos here. There's over 320 videos. Have fun, get on some playlists, and get good at the game. Alright guys, so as you know, I like to get the updates for you guys before they come out. And this next update will be dropping between tomorrow and Thursday, I'm pretty sure. So, let's go ahead and get into it. Alright, the first one, the Sage Tower opens. You can unlock the Sage Tower when your castle reaches level 23. I think this is a Sage Tower here. There are ancient books in the Sage Tower. Powerful occult were written in them. So, probably like spells and magic. You need to spend resources and research stones to analyze the occult, which will increase your power substantially. So, I'm guessing that you'll get buffs by donating resources and research stones to the um, tower right here, the Sage Tower, where you... Um, get the occult kind of reminds me of Harry Potter the little like ledge there it goes right there All right um, You need to spend okay. We already went over that okay the research workshop open so you can unlock the research workshop when you're level 23 castle um, This is where you produce research stones So I think that's like right here you can unlock two of them the maximum of two research workshops So I'm guessing the research workshops will go right here and you'll have two of them that's where you're going to build your research stones at so it's pretty cool that they at least give you an area to make research stones hero capture opens here's the prison and the cemetery by the way prisons on the right cemeteries on the left you can you have a chance to capture the other lords heroes if you win the battle and send them into your prison you can torture or release the captured hero if you execute the hero they will go back to their lord's cemetery and wait to re revive so if you capture someone's um, hero it'll go into your prison and you can either torture or release it I'm guessing you would torture it um, if you do kill it then it will go to the cemetery of the other person and then they can revive it probably have to spend resources or gold or something to revive it all captured heroes will be released if you activate the peace shield so if you capture a hero and then you shield up it'll automatically go back to the person so if you want to capture it and then torture it or kill it you're going to have to at least stay unshielded and uh, fight. So I'm guessing if you you just want to kill it immediately if you plan on shielding. So that way he at least has to uh, revive it. Alright, let's go to the next one. When the castle is destroyed, all captured heroes from the winning alliance will be released. So um, if you do get destroyed, all the heroes will get sent back to the people who destroyed you. If you like capture them, say you win a couple battles, capture the heroes... Then they hit you again and again and again you die like in the dragon campaign or ancient battlefield then all the heroes return okay the prison and cemetery open you can now build the prison and cemetery in the torrent valley area that's this area this is torrent valley and this is the prison on the right cemetery on the left the prison is where you hold the captured heroes the cemetery can be used to revive the dead heroes the reborn hero will not have any losses Thanksgiving event. Okay, that's a new event coming. During the event, you will find mysterious merchants by killing monsters in the world. Okay, so it's going to be a monster event. Go ahead and get your support ready. Go ahead and put all your skills into support for that monster march speed. And get your 11, level 5 dragon glass on for that 100, 200%, whatever you got. They have limited rewards and gifts. Um, to the first 30 lords who approach them so it's kind of like the Christmas event from last year where you would go to the Santas and they would give so many lords um, presents so that's cool you can also get turkey and magic wands from the wishing well use them to get a surprise gifts okay so you're gonna get turkeys and magic wands in the wishing well so if you got a bunch of wishes this will be the time to use them you have a chance to obtain the blue dragon crystal and the in the glitter gift box so I'm not sure where the glitter gift box will be but you can get some blue dragon crystal which are always good Mother's Day event um, I didn't know it was Mother's Day yet I thought that was a ways away during the event you have a chance to win to get the little bears biscuit collect resources in the world to get pink carnation I'm guessing it's Mother's Day in like China or something's why they're saying that Optimization. Out of the new announcement for the Dragon Tower and Hero Trials. Out of the Hero and Dragon in the Formation settings. Okay, that's cool. Added Recommended Level and Wounded Troop 
info in the hero trials interface added item access info for magic stone dragon gift dragon skill vip keys and lucky keys if you win a rare prize when opening the lucky chest or the lucky wheel it will have a special display the magic mirror can search for the lords who have the most abundant resources non-safe resources in the kingdom okay so within the next two days we'll uh or two or three days we'll have this new update i'm guessing it's going to be here by thursday that's what i was told so hopefully this gives you guys a little bit of a head start hopefully you'll be able to prepare and hopefully you'll be able to capture some heroes torture them don't torture um bernard too much he will probably like it let's go ahead and look at bernard again what's his name again the exploiter bernard the exploiter he has a whip and he loves to please the king so um yeah just be easy on bernard you know you might crack him one time and he might like it and you never know what could happen in the you know the jail cell i don't know they probably had that like lard fat soap back in the day too so you know that stuff's like real slippery so just be very careful is all i'm saying so thank you guys so much for watching teamwork makes dreamwork smash that thumbs up button click these videos are popping on the screen right now hit that subscribe button in the top right corner i'll see you guys in the next video peace